my bo from the frozen oh, water. Oh, okay. It just sounded like you were unlocking something. No, I just haven't been the drink from a bottle. So a water okay, okay. I had, which I froze. How well preserved was the plane? <laughs> Pretty much what you'd expect. Brad, it was insane. It was like traveling through time. No shit. Well, it was like traveling <laughs> through time and accidentally ending up in a dimension where the past is underwater and like everything is covered in barnacles. She's a little overexcited. I think she's had five reef. Red Bulls uh, in ten minutes. Hey, I thought it was is pretty it just intense. me? She's got that crazy Wasn't look in her eye like, more beers after he helped 25 twist. hours. Yeah. Maybe he decided, hey, I'll drink some. And then he got drunk. And since he was drunk, he forgot to bring Am it to anyone? us. Am I the only one? She's got that glazed, drinking, deranged look about her. Yeah, sounds like you've had some experience with this kind of phenomenon. Yeah, I've been studying it for years. I'll go look for him. Oh, we found a bullet lodged in the plane. Huh. I left it below deck if you want to check it out. I like her top, but I could never pull that off. Hey Hi. there, polar bear. You good? Sorry, uh... I was just thinking about how crazy our dive was. Can you believe what we just got to experience? <clears throat> I expected it to be cool, but that was that was like life changing. Oh yeah. This is definitely without a doubt anti-aircraft caliber heat right here. Wow. Uh, every trip we take we together go, is I memorable. Guess. You know. <sighs> okay. Oh. Whoa. Oh, there we go. You smoochy, smoochy. There we go. Appreciate it while you can, because one of you will probably be dead by Man the overboard. end of this. Man overboard. What? What? And it'll Alex probably be edge. my fault. Into the drink. Oh god, it's horrible. Oh, the humanity. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, man, you guys should see your faces. That is not a cool thing to do. Yeah. Sorry. I didn't mean to interrupt. Oh yeah, the beers. I was just getting them now. I just interrupted. Hey, Brad, how you doing? Going on? All right. Here. Nothing to worry about, sis. As things. Just getting them beers. I know, right? So my pinker. I'm just like, I want to know what the fuck is going on. I really want to get this sussed, and I really want to see how many people I can save. Well, to be fair, we're playing. This is all basically. This is our cast. All right. Mm. Now that everybody's here, let's take a look at the navigator's pad we found. Maybe we can figure out why the plane was out here. Where'd you put it? It's in your case. Okay, I'll go get it. Hey. Okay. Where is my... Oh. You alright? You seem nope. kind of preoccupied. That's the barbecue. Where's nah, my case? I'm good. Sorry. Didn't realize I was spacing out. Case? Dog? How do you think the day went? Other than our little tight 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 with the locals? Pretty good. People always say they have dive experience, but Alex and Julia seem to actually know what they're doing. Nice. So, <coughs> we're going again tomorrow? No. Air rescue service. Sign me up. Conwin Can't wait to see Island. this sucker for myself. Hey, got the pad yet? Sorry, okay. I got distracted. <coughs> no worries. Let's go get it. Conwin Island. Ratter for Brayson Lee. Mm. You got a girlfriend? Uh, not my strong suit. Hey, nothing to be ashamed of. We all hit our stride eventually. No, no, no don't get distracted. No, 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 bad idea. Ew. I can wait for when you're back at port. Dudes make too big a- Right here. Come okay, on. Need to keep those two lovebirds under control. Uh, wow. I think the having beers thing is probably not a good idea either, but... <laughs> You'll get no resistance there. Alright, everyone. Check it out. Manchurian gold. Oh. Who wants to find some sunken treasure? Okay. So what do you think, Captain? Coordinates? Those are coordinates, alright. Maybe the plane's destination? You think we could get there by tomorrow? It takes a couple I hours to the I want to check on a map steady. first. Wow. See where that you is. Find anything else? There was a flight plan on board that seemed to indicate it was a rescue plane. Yeah. That makes sense. After the war, they turned long-range bombers into rescue planes. And then this plane must have been shot down because it was riddled with bullet holes. I found one lodged in the fuselage. Huh. And it was full of life rafts. Must have gotten shot down before they could deliver all the rafts. There was only one missing. Reckless. All of you. Excuse me? I told you to leave everything down there alone. Oh, come on. We've been through this already. I'm not talking about the law. No, hey. They were respectful. No, you did whatever you wanted. 
Whatever you took, it was too much. Oh no. What are you gonna say? You're right. We should have been more careful. That's not me, I'm sorry. Okay, maybe. I don't know you. You should have never gone down to that plane in the first place. It's bad luck. You think you can scavenge down there and it makes no difference, but every single thing you bring back has an essence. It's like a ghost you invite to the surface. Here we go. Huh. I never thought about it like that. You never think about much of anything. Well, maybe I never heard about such cool ghost stories. They're not cool ghost stories. Not like for fun. People drown in these waters and you have to respect their resting place. Damn straight. Fred, you got a fun ghost story, right? Oh, here we go. Y yeah, I, I heard <sighs> a story. It happened right around here, too. Let's hear it. We could all use a good show. Let's hear it. I bet you can spin a good Maybe it's yarn. Extra info. It's kind of nice. messed up, actually. <laughs> I want to hear the extra Scare info. Scare away, little bro. Okay. Like, I think this might be relevant here goes. Later. This story is true. It had happened right near here, in an old lighthouse. Classic setup. Wait, true story? Where'd you hear this? Ah, well. Down by the dockside, I found an ancient old man, skin like a leather book, eye patch, wooden leg, the whole nine yards. And for a dollar, he told me his secrets. Seems legit. That's a light cheap secret. Stood atop an atoll, isolated from I'd the rest of the world. Of that. A lone beacon in the night, a sailor's respite. The lighthouse keeper would hear the waves pounding the rocky shore. One misty morning, he comes upon a woman covered in blood. She's stumbling down the beach. He hurries to her aid, and she falls into his arms, sobbing. As he hurries her back to the lighthouse, he asks where she's from. He doesn't waste any time. Smooth. Shh. The woman answers. I live here, in the lighthouse. My parents are upstairs right now. Twist. Of course, the lighthouse keeper says, that isn't so. Of course, he's lived there alone for years. And the woman becomes hysterical, and his sister parents are upstairs. So. They go to the top of the lighthouse, and there, splayed out on the floor, is a man and a woman brutally murdered with an axe. Always an axe. I mean, do people even use axes anymore? I'm just reporting the facts, cliches and all. Chopped up into little tiny giblets with an axe. What do you think this story so far? So gross. Pretty nasty. Okay, so who did it? The woman says, it was my brother. And she turns to the closet and says, he's hiding in there. Ah, oh, great. Blame the brother. <laughs> so the <lighthouse> <laughs> the closet, opens the door, and sure enough, there's a man inside. But he's cut his own throat. Horrified. He looks closer to see the dead man's face in the dark. Closer. Closer. And he sees. It's his own face. And then its eyes bulge out and screams. That <laughs> 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 so nearly got me. Nearly. Super twist. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. Nearly. Nice one, Squire. You have me going. Pretty cool. I think he told it better last time. But good effort. Okay. Um, the one You've I have had your is fun? the Polar we should H10. Turn in. There's some weather hitting our way. Uh -uh. There's a H9, no, no, no. but it no, hasn't got good Bluetooth connectivity. According to standard vessel regulation, we're all so, yeah, required. I'd one more beer the, before hitting uh, H10. H10. What regulations are these? I'm using right now, and it works standard really well. Standard issue so regulatory got, um, institutional um, protocol with a subdivision 1099. Uh -huh. Which is an application. It will be called highlights for you. It's really extremely friendly. Very, very good. Very, very useful. I'm into this website. App is free, but there's a paid version you can get with extra widgets and the um polar h10 is about 72 pounds on amazon uk yeah the pulse side guys guys actually came into my stream a while back really really uh yeah they're really lovely very nice We've got some creeps on deck. 
Why do I feel like these are the same guys from earlier? Yeah. We're not gonna be able to get out of this. There's only one way in and out. Oh fuck. No, 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 no. <coughs> oh shit. I'm in trouble. <gasps> oh, come off it. No! How the fuck are we going to escape this? They're going to lock us in the sink boat, aren't they? There was a premonition earlier where I saw somebody, I think, drowning or the ship sinking and they would aggressively drowning. Mm. I get a feeling that's what they're going to do to us. Really? Provided the premonition is correct. Right, we got to find a way out of here. We're going to do it quick. Yeah. Right, we need to get the tape <sighs> off, get everybody's hands on cough. <laughs> Oh, why did I uncack the noisy shit first? Oh, I should have done the other one. Oh, come on. Ah. Yeah, that's about it. Hey, I'm Brian. <laughs> Quick, uncack someone. <laughs> okay, now you've got one last person to uncag. Yeah, I'm gonna get Mung Gag first because at least then everybody can talk then. Yeah. As needed. I'm not gonna let Gobby McGobby shite talk. You know that used to be Iceman, right? <sighs> hey! Hey! Oh, Damn fuck, it. here we Stop go. It. <sighs> yeah, good, Ra. Good. Almost free. We just need to get out of this awkward situation. Hey, so, uh, good news, bad news. Bad news? I don't see how this could get any worse. The bad news is these are kind of maybe the fishermen I missed off earlier. Oh, God damn it, Conrad. Great, just great. And the good news? Uh, I recognize them. How is that good news? I thought you were going to ask the good news first. You're such an idiot. Jesus. Let's get people untied first. Right now. Let's get people untied and move first. I think that's the priority, really, rather than yapping. Yeah. Because yapping can wait for later oh. while we're moving around. No dice. So I'm taking it to the approach to get everybody untied. That's more hands on deck to help. <laughs> right? Yeah. Then we can talk, but we'll have to talk really quietly so that we don't, like, piss them off more. Yeah. I think that's probably going to be the best way to deal with this, but we need to go find Fliss fast because we don't know what she's done with them. Well, where she, what's been done to her, should I say? Just one more hand and type can retaliate. Oh shit! I missed that. Oh, come on. Oh, he speaks English. I'll be back for you later. No, 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 no. Kick him! Kick him in the nuts! God dang it. I missed that punch. Nobody knows you're out here, little lady. Uh, you're all alone with us now. Let's make the okay, most of it. You can go fuck yourself, you out. piece of shit. You're the little lady. Okay. It's going good, Ola. Don't stress, let's get get sorted. Gotta be honest with information. What do you fuckers want? This is irrational, but we'll see what we can do. 
Oh no. Please, no. Don't. Stop! Come on. Please, just stop. Slow down. Easy. Oh no. Uh, this might be the first act of character. Please. Just stop, man. It's not on me. I didn't do anything to. Please.